Welcome back to Pride Plays. In the last episode, um, I did my best to deliver a epic breakout, and uh, I did okay. <laughs> Just okay. But now we are back to Dathomir. Oh! Oh! And there's zombies. Oh, was what I was trying to say is there's zombies here from the last time we came here and pissed off the uh, night sister. Yes. But uh, we also learned that uh, I think his name is Malachi. Uh, no, it can't be Malachi. I would totally remember his name being Malachi. Maybe it's just Malik. So, uh, Malik, the guy we met back here, turned out to be a fallen Jedi. And so he's back here doing evil shit. But we need that, uh... Uh, that thing. The key. I'm struggling to remember what it's called, mostly because I'm fighting witches. The Astrium. We need the Astrium. And, uh, I forgot to start my timer. Boom. We're here for the Astrium. Otherwise, I think we would probably just leave these guys to do whatever. Screw you. Right. But, uh, we're here. We look cool. New lightsaber. New attitude. It's gonna be awesome. Unless, of course, I die! Help! Help, please! <laughs> BD, do something! Whew. Okay. Could be better, but that's okay. Because we're pretty much here. Because luckily, when you come back here, all you have to do is come, like, right back to the temple. And, uh, because you have all the, uh, equipment you need to do that, it's no big deal. I mean, technically, you could look around for, uh, any echoes you missed, but there's no need for that. Oh, almost had me there. He's quick. Watch your head. You're fun. Is this what passes for a Jedi now? That's mean. Now we can just focus on each other. Go on, do something. You look small. Damn! Oh, I really wanted to get that guy. Oh, he attacks so frequently. You can only parry one of his moves. It doesn't even stun him when you do it. So, like, the window for actually hitting him is pretty small. You know what? I should have slowed him. That would have, that would have given me as big a window as I wanted. Damn! I think my biggest problem is I don't like using the force powers that much. I like using just the lightsaber. It just feels cooler that way. I feel kind of cheap using force powers. But you know they give them to you for a reason. So why why would you not use them? I don't know. I just feel weird about it. It's not a big deal. Don't worry what I do. Oh my. Well. Yeah, this is a problem sometimes. Um, sometimes it takes them a hot second to uh, render the enemies in here. Where's the other one? I was say, I know there was two of them. Alright. 
Hopefully they're still there. Those bounty hunters. I want another shot at them. I don't see them. Yeah. Well, at least my XP is sitting right here. Man, I hate that. I hate that you just miss out like that. It sucks. Alright. Well, uh, if you remember the door last time, um, it was basically locked and we tried, tried everything. We tried kicking it. We tried spinning on it. Just nothing was unlocking this door. Which I guess is no surprise when you're trying to unlock it with spit. But, you know, you never know. It's Star Wars. Crazy shit happens. But what we actually need is, like, inner peace to open this door. And inner peace we now have. You were wrong to return here unarmed. Not unarmed. You think that lightsaber proves you were Jedi? No. Facing you. Memories that have haunted me since Bracca. I won't run from them anymore. Then let us see what manner of death your courage brings. So, like, you just kind of clash wieners with them, but then you turn your lightsaber off. And you're like, I don't want to touch wieners anymore. And then he fucks your face. Just kidding. Uh, it's a test. <laughs> it's a very sick, decrepit test. The loss has become a part of me. Decrepit's not the right word for that, but I wanted to use it anyway. And your sacrifice. He's like, okay. See, we just need inner peace to open the door. Which kind of makes you wonder how everybody else has been opening the door, but, uh... Okay. Whoa, hey guys. Stop him from moving. Brothers, me. Him. You only in peace. All right, that's it. Okay, that was that was okay. Oh, that one actually uh, kept shooting until he died. That doesn't happen often. Normally they wait for me to come up here for my back to very obviously be turned. So, Malos? I already. Malikos. What did I say? Malachi? Pretty close. So, Malikos made a deal with the Night Sister to, I think, avenge her fallen sisters, and in return, she would teach him how to use uh, Death and Mirror Magic. So he's going to be pretty tough. But like, lore tough, not like actually tough. He's not that hard. Maybe. Marin, right? I'm going to change that lightsaber again. I just can't. It's not good. What you were told about the Jedi was not true. So you say. But I'll do that later. Said many things too. Also, uh, when she takes her hood off, she's super hot. I have no idea. 
All I do know is having a lightsaber isn't what makes you a Jedi. Then what does? We were peacekeepers. You can see Malakos just chilling in the background. Protected. Pretending to ignore me. I, I might be one of the last of my kind. I was only a child when they attacked. An armored warrior brandishing this descended upon us and cut down my people. My sisters. Until I was left alone. With the dead. Then Malikos came. And promised me revenge. If I shared our secrets with him in return. I know what it's like to lose everything. And Malikos was wrong to use that against you. We don't have to be enemies. We will need this. There she goes again. I'll be watching. Let's get out of here. Yeah, so I totally have a crush on her, but you could turn back. that's okay. Don't worry about it. She's not real. She's not real. Doesn't matter. But if she was, oh, ho, 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 ho. be writing her love letters or something. I don't. It, <laughs> That's <laughs> enough about that. But uh, that's, a, that's a nice big echo right there. And now we go to fight Malikos. Because look at him. He looks evil. <laughs> Don't use my full name, dude. Come on. Begin your training. What in these ruins tempts you so much? I could ask you the same thing. There's power there. You don't Jedi understand power I control. Ah, uh, yes, power. I would offer you the same thing. Don't you understand? I'm not interested in power. I want to restore the order. Restore the Jedi order. Oh, you poor fool. It's over. Jedi fell long before the purge. Stifled by tradition, deafened by our past glories, blinded by endless war. Maybe, but it's never over, Malikos. We stand here now, the chance to learn, to rebuild from our mistakes. Jedi learn. There's no future for them. Why can you not see that? It's time for something new. You and me. We could build something different. Something better. No. Dathomir will be your grave. Well, the game may be called Jedi Fallen Order, but we're about to slay us a fallen Jedi. But that will be next time on Pride Plays. So uh, let's see if you guys can hold out till then. But thank you guys for tuning in and we'll see you next time.